Hello and welcome to Chasing Diecast Cars. This is the second video to celebrate the 100th anniversary of Citroën. Uh, this video will be about the non-iconic cars, at least according to Citroën. I'm going to show them small to big. Following order will be a little bit off, but that's just easier to do it this way. And at the end we're going to look at some rally and race cars. First up is this Welly. This is the C1. This is an uh, older version of uh, their smallest car. But nicely done, lots of details. Then another Welly, the C2. This is also an older model. This is an older style packaging too that you don't get to see anymore these days. It's strongly locked in there. There you go. So, 2003 C2, not the prettiest Citroën ever made, I must say. Then we go to the C3 by Majoret, kind of a silverish version, 2011 release. Doesn't seem to have suspension, no, because I did not see any suspension bars. It's got detailed headlights and tail lights and a uh, kind of a moonroof. Very bright interior. Also came in blue. This version you can find everywhere. Two thousand and twelve release. This is a the next version. This is a Norev, but the should say the mainline Norev, so not a premium Norev. They have a a, a small line of vehicles. Uh, this kind of a mainline. Uh, they also seem a little bit smaller. They seem closer to 164 scale. The more premium ones are more three inch. This has a, also a windscreen that runs to halfway of the roof. Uh, these don't have the authentic wheels that uh, Norev usually has. These are more simple versions. Then we got the new C3 done by Majorette. This was new for 2018. This one does have suspension. Here I have a older Siku, a Santia. This one has the opening doors, plastic base, metal body, pretty heavy model. Got the tail lights, the headlights, the double chevron, the Citroën, Citroën emblem. Then we have the only Hot Wheels Citroën, the C4 Rally. And I think they made like uh, five or six different versions of this one. This was a Hot Wheels premiere in 2010. This 
this is the only one that uh, does not have the first release uh, is plain and the other ones have tempos on the side so very clean version I wanted to say chrome tear of course Majorette also did this car not in a rally version but the whoops sorry the standard version And there's an uh, other version I have. I don't know if it'll show up on camera, but the colors differ a little bit. It's got different rims, but all in all, not that different. Got a red version too, and a kind of a silver version that does not have an interior. As this one does. But it does might might have an interior. Yes, it does have an interior, but the windows are really dark. That's what it is. Then we have the C4 by Norev, more modern version. We got the authentic wheels, got the moon roof. Also have this version. This one does not have the moon roof. It's got the uh, blue roof, black authentic wheels. But this is uh, the DS4. Sorry, it's not a C4. But I left this one here so you can compare. So DS is the luxury brand of Citroën. Um, these are in basically the same cars but in the styling is much different. Although you can recognize the C4 still in this one. So left the C4 and right the DS4. So you can see there's a little difference here and there. Not much. And then we got another DS4 in black. It's got the chrome authentic wheels. Majorette also did the DS4. Very similar. Of course, the Majorette does not have the authentic wheels. This particular version has rubber tires. This is a motor car. Where this is the regular streetcars version so it's pretty much the same except for the rubber tires and the rims and there's one important difference when you look at the interior you can see there's a plastic piece that is kind of an uh, engine cover for the engine driving the rear wheels in this motor car where of course in this one you have the complete seats and look at the nice detail on the seats very nicely done but also uh, Norev has done that there you go, very detailed on the inside. Also have this in a limited edition version. So 
no, no opening parts on these, but they do have suspension majorettes. This is the 2018 release. Also have a police version of it, two actually. So these are both pretty much the same, with one difference. The left one has blacked out windows, the right one has clear windows. And that's the reason why. Also got it in white, in a ambulance version. It's got working lights, but it's too bright here to, uh, to see that. And here we got the flipper by Norev. This is the DS5. This is a bigger version bigger than the DS4. So it's got uh, three sunroofs. Authentic wheels as usual. Then there was the C5. Got a few versions of that one. Different rims and also a little color variation. It's got some opening doors uh, and should have suspension, but not much. So it's a little difference in color, but hard to see. Also got it in white. The shape of the rear window is pretty special. And I also have a station wagon version of this one. This is a Norev, and surpri surprisingly, this one has suspension. Never seen that before on a Norev. That's cool. Very nice version, this one. Also has the big moonroof. And then we go to some SUVs. The C Crosser. This is a, these are all going to be majorettes. It's got a big trailer hitch on it. So it has no, no suspension. That is in blue. And I've got this beach version. So as you see, sometimes Matred also does some graphics on their vehicles, some tempos on the side. But doesn't happen very often. Then before we go to the rally cars, I've got a uh, Gran Turismo car here by Norev. And then we go to the sporty ones. Oh, there's a ring inside the packaging. That's because I dropped it. You could hear it drop a few minutes ago. I'm going to have to repair this one. So these rims just pop in to these uh, wheels. Just like that. 
So this is the C4 coupe, like we saw the regular versions of the red Hot Wheels and the blue uh, Majorette, red Majorette and the kind of silver silver Majorette. And then we got the DS3. Red Bull livery. The uh, Abu Dhabi version. And then we go to some majorettes. No suspension. Doesn't need to. The rally cars. Here we have also some Abu Dhabi versions. These don't have an interior and they have uh, some kind of a strange post in, uh, underneath the windscreen. I don't know if you will be able to see it. There you go. I don't know what that is for, but. They all have that. Another Abu Dhabi one. Here's a Burago version. It's not the rally or race car, but it just fit in the DS3 theme. Uh, they claim it is 164 scale, but of course it is totally not. It's much bigger than 164 scale. This nicely detailed, and then the last one is this C. Elysee by Norav. The big wing on the back, four door car. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. I hope to see you again next time. Bye bye.